I'll warn the rest of the party that hey, it seems that uh, something's been hit through here recently. Let's keep an eye out. I'll move up. Right here. This corner, I'll peer down. There you are. Keep going. As I get down here, I'm going to roll a perception check, see if I can see anything in that distant darkness. Ah, okay. 16. Probably not. Suspiciously familiar, so uh, I'm yeah, well, there's only so many chambers in this set. Yeah, I know. I'm just gonna move up to the left, John, because I have a feeling out of character, but in character, Belgard obviously doesn't see I it. think be long before you get to the lip, you're gonna get mowed down. So hang on, okay? Yep, just tell me where, Go you're back where you were. Yep, move back again. There you go. Oh, maybe not. Yeah. The guy in the back who has the best line of sight to you is too far away. Yeah, I had a feeling. I was thinking it was a little bit too far away just from how the other ones have been. Yeah, I guess the most obvious thing is you have 60 feet of vision and that's how far the short bows go. Yeah, that's that's usually what I know. I'm, I'm in gun line ranges when I actually see them. So uh, I'll move up. Obviously, I, I don't, Belgar doesn't know. So I'll move up to the lift if that's fine. Yep, that's fine. Right here and they'll see me. So at that point, uh, so this guy can fire on you. Missing Miss. horribly. Yep. And then the one, two, three, four at the top can fire on you. Oh, pair of hits in there. Yep. Just the first two. He'll luck up that 19. I'll luck it down. I feel like being crit. You don't feel like being crit? No, I saw what you did to Aegon. I'm not interested. <laughs> I strongly disapprove. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's just two hits. Five and four. Okay. Two poison saves. Two passes. And then we're on to initiative. Yes, sir. I got gathered again, but also when that ends well. Okay, Vincent, you're up first. Sneak around the corner. I can just barely see that guy way in the back, but I, I can't really see what's next to him, if anything, so I'm just going to keep moving up. That's my turn. Okay, uh, then we're on to the hunter. So he will attack Belagar. They 
15. That's terrible. That's a, oh, that's a hit. It's oh, it, that's a hit. Oh, my God. It's, it's not hard to hit me. Uh, Ooh, okay. six points, too. Down, poison save. Pass. Okay, so the three in the back. Yeah, they'll all attack Belagar. Okay. Belagar is dying for your sins. Each and every one of your sins. Remember this? Two hits. 19. Oh, and that's the... Oh, no, that's not the guy with the, the used his luck, so he will luck up that one. God damn it. Save me. Got to get some real uh, crit. Oh, crit on the crit. Um, fuck. Uh... <laughs> Unfortunately, that's just to confirm, so. Okay, let's say if he crit on the crit. Oh, max damage, too. So 18 points of damage. We're here to fuck you up. Belagar is dying for your sins, each and every one of them. <laughs> okay, then we're on to Aegon. Aegon's going to delay until after Belagar. Interesting choice. Well, unfortunately, I have to go in front of you, Aegon, right now. Again. Um, but what I will do is I will go there just for the fact so if Belgar moves, you can move up without going through, and then I'm going to give Belgar uh, 15 hit points back. Thank you. And it's my, my turn, turn, yeah? <laughs> okay. I'm going to bridge. my HP, and I'm going to charge this guy. Okay, on your way over there, the so, other hunter will pluck an arrow at you. Yes, sir. That's it. 18. For four points, and then these three can now target you. Pass. Oh, Miss Beth, God. one hit. Awful dog shit rolls. Tempest is with me. Five more points. Yep. Pass. Okay, I'm still up. Praise be to Tempest. Mashallah. Uh, let's see. If I charge 14. No, 15 because he's Goblin. Now that's oh, cool. and that's a crit. That's a confirm. He's dead. Just a casual. Let's see. The casual 79 damage to the face. Nice. Okay. Uh, then we're on to Aegon. Okay. Aegon's going to move up to here. Uh, no, not to there. He's going to move over to here. And uh, I'm going to use my Swift and my standard to boost my initiative next turn. Okay. Then we're back to initiative. Ooh. Where did Belagar go? I don't know. I think my thing messed up. Can't even click on anything on my team screen. Alright, I'll refresh this. You deleted your token. 
Did I? I typed in 19, but I guess I accidentally deleted it. My bad. Sorry. Control Z, maybe? I fixed it. Hmm. Okay, Egan, you're up first. Alrighty. Um, Belagar went full Jesse. Never go full Jesse. Well, I can't even. I can't even see the map now. I think I deleted myself like a dumbass. I don't know how I did that, though. No, when I undid you, I was on the GM's layer, so it put your token on the GM's layer. Uh, okay. I didn't realize until I went back to the token layer. I'm gonna move up here next to Belagar. And... Charge this hunter. Thanks. Does he have a bow? Yep. Okay. So charges two four, so that's plus thirteen. He's dead. Okay, Jerome at your go. All right, I'm going to. Guess I just single move there five. Uh, can I charge through there? Nope. Okay, I'll activate my shield and hold my longsword two handed and move this. Ho ho ho! Uh oh. I'm in danger. That's my turn. That is a nice turn. Oh, Jerome. Vincent, you're up. Belagar roll a 19 for initiative? Yep. I rolled a 20. I'm going to cast Expeditious Retreat on myself. Good idea. You're ready. So you're ready to run faster. for his life. No, I'm sneaking faster. I'm having trouble keeping up with people. Okay, you doing anything else? I'll sneak up here. That's my turn. Oh, baby. It's my turn. Okay, Belagar, you're up. Hmm. Quick question. Does uh, me gaining Tempest affiliation, like, do I gain the ability retroactively? Or do I have to go pay tithe again? You have to tithe again. Okay, makes sense. You have to rest, at least. Jerome went south, and he started crying. <laughs> or screaming for help, so I'm gonna go help him. Egan, you got this? Yeah, yeah, I got this. Move up here. I'm going to notice that. I'm going to five foot step and help Jerome. So here we go. Plus 13. That's a hit. That's a kill. Nice. Very nice indeed. That'll be my turn. Okay. I should get some sort of affiliation bonus for helping someone make you one shots. Uh oh. <laughs> yep. Uh, uh oh would definitely be the term that I would use. Oh no. Oh yes. I think it's time to uh, charge in the opposite direction, guys. Real, real quick question, John. Are you going to do the one-hit kill bonus for all the other chaotic neutral ones as well? Or chaotic good or whatever the religions are? Uh, not for everyone, no. Okay. Is that a web? That is a web. I think I have a way of getting you out of this, Belagar. Okay. Web is that big? 
it's huge. Web's fucking massive. Yeah, it's a twenty foot uh, area. Do we get a save, or we just fuck? You get a reflex save, yeah. You get a save, but you're also fucked even if you make it. I'm pretty sure we still have the bless up because I. Well, maybe not. How? Bless is only around a level, I believe. It's one minute a level. Was well, it a minute level? If it's a minute level, you'd still have it. Okay. okay well, here goes nothing. I'm just gonna. Yeah, shot. that's when you moved up there, Vincent. Yeah, I was like, that is oh, perfect. Never mind. I can't see you. Nothing uh, but net, baby. I have a. Uh, I have a. Uh, two to do this. What's the DC? Uh, the DC is 15. I'll lock myself up to avoid it. Yeah, there's no way I'm fucking making that check. No way in God's green earth. So, Webb, you're just restrained, correct? If you fail the save, you're fucked. Great! It's just entangled, fucking right? Fucking great! I'm looking it up. But I'm pretty sure if you you're entangled if you're inside it. Yeah, you are. If the save succeeds, the creature is entangled but not prevented from moving. The moving is more difficult than normal for being entangled. If the save fails, the creature is entangled and can't move from its base, but can break loose by spending one round, making a DC 20 strength check or a DC 25 escape artist check. Oh. Oh. Once you're loose, you're still entangled, which means you get half speed and some other penalties, but you can move through the web very slowly. Each round devoted entirely to moving allows you to make a strength check or escape artist check. You move five for feet for each five full points, but I wish the check exceeds ten. Uh, someone just burned the net. I will take the fire damage. Someone just burned the net. Yeah, I usually you just burn it. Don't worry. That's the next thing he's going to do. <laughs> burn, baby, burn! It's a disco inferno. I don't like that. What, Disco or Inferno? Well, I don't like when they go together. They're nice separately. Come okay. On, that's a great song, um, right? Yeah, he can't really do anything else because everyone's webbed, so I was not expecting to get the whole party with that. I was hoping to get two players with it. When Aegon moved up, I was like, oh, that's perfect. And then Jerome moved up, and I was like, oh, wow, they're all going to do it. Then Vincent moved up. Mistakes okay, so if you're in the web but close to the edge, does that give you like cover? No idea. Uh, I you're think the it's DM. Oh, oh, if you have at least five feet of web between you and the opponent, it provides cover. If you have at least okay. twenty feet of web so between you, target. So does, does not have any web between him and the three archers uh, to the north. Uh, he definitely has some between him and this one, but the other two, yes. He would yeah, the three at the north, he doesn't. Okay, let's see their roll. Oh, okay, sorry, I can't see gonna, them. They're gonna get me. <clears throat> uh, one mess, two hits. Oh, you're not raging? Oh, I'm raging. That negative seven doesn't hit. Or that seven doesn't hit, though. Oh, okay, I thought you said, uh, one, one hit. No, 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 I said two, sorry. I said one miss, my bad. No damage. Next one. No damage, just two saves. Two saves. Elgar, I'm going to need you, if you go before me, to delay until after my turn, okay? I'm going to do something to you. <laughs> That's something you want to hear. Very menacing. <laughs> I just hope the initiative D and D gods are on my side. <laughs> oh, a ten is that's it? That's it on you, isn't it, Belgar? Oh, even I went before. What the hell, Belgar? Ten a hit on you? Ah, uh, ten? Yeah. If I'm entangled, yeah. Oh yeah, you suffer even more penalties. Mm -hmm. With well, yeah, no damage, but save coming. Ah, uh, anyone can look that up. Uh, someone have a plus two? I think Egan does. Yeah, I can get you. You don't need your luck for your own saves, so. Well, he does need it for his saves because he's entangled. Oh, yeah, he does. 
Yeah, but Balagar staying up is more important. That plus, uh, I'm not caught in the web. I can move. Oh, are you not? Okay. Uh, so I, I rolled a twenty. Up. I rolled a twenty, uh, Jesse, on my save for that. Okay. So. Okay. And hit Belagar as well. Yep. I see the deets. One damage. Fuck it. Even though yep. it's gonna set them all up perfectly for like a sound burst or whatever, that's not gonna happen anytime soon. So the big guy, I'll move up too. Nope. Wait, wait, wait. That oh, that's a nat fail for him. So no. Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, I, I'm stuck in the in the <laughs> web, and he's missing. <laughs> unfortunately, he misses on a one, two, or three automatically, despite the fact that he could hit you on those. Yeah. Sorry, bud. Obviously, hey, that's a bitch. <laughs> a jerk in the web and just whizzes right by my head. <laughs> okay, well, we're back to initiative then. Alright, I rolled a 13, so... I'm gonna need you to go after me, Belagar. Mm, uh, okay. Huh. I guess I'll be delaying my turn to the end of the round. <laughs> <laughs> if you want an enlarged person, you'll wait. Oh, oh yeah, I can wait. <laughs> Are you entangled, Jerome? Yeah, but I, it, I I should still be able to cast spells, no? I don't think so. Let's Entang see, 3.5 ent Entangled. Entangled, I uh, cannot run or char. An Entangled creature moves at speed. Uh, mm -hmm. Must make a concentration track DC 15 plus the spell's level. Or lose the spell, so I'll try it. 15 plus the spell level, which is 3. I should be able to make an 8, 19. Well, I think they're or, uh eighteen. No, well, it's, no, no. It's only sixteen. DC sixteen. The large person's a uh, first level spell. Yeah, I think Agen's up first. Uh, let's see how it goes. Agen, what are you doing? Alrighty. Uh, I have to make a strength and athletics check. Correct. Strength. Strength. Strength check. DC Straight 20. strength. DC twenty. You need to roll a fifteen yep. or higher, buddy. Awesome. I believe in you. I believe in you, too. I believe you're going to fail, though. I fucking <laughs> believe in it. Easy. The and I can move. Hard I can move maybe. nothing. Yeah, you I freed yourself with that, too, dude. It. Okay. I can't move five feet? Nope. Okay. No, that just means you're free now. Oh, okay. So the shaman will cast Blur. What a bastard. The shaman had more prep time. Well, here, here's our dumbasses clunking all the way through the hall. <laughs> but also the well, the biggest giveaway is the beacons of light coming down the hall. You can't see into the room until your beacon of light gets into the room, but they can see your beacon 60 feet down the hall, so they have lots yeah. of time to prep. That was the problem with the other cave setup, is they couldn't really see you until you came right into the cave. Yeah. Okay, so the shaman went, then it is the uh, hunters. Hunter. One, two, three, four, five, six of them. That's unfortunate. Are they shooting me? Oh, hell yeah. Mess, oh! Mess, Look at that. Hits. Nines are hits, aren't they? Oh, yeah, you're right. I'm entangled. Yeah. Uh, is that on Five Aiden? hits. That was on me. Oh, shit. Okay. Little bits of Belagar all over the floor. No damage, no damage. And then Only one, one, five, or four. Only six points. Yeah, it's not too bad. I'm still up. Just make every single save now. Oh! Natural yeah. three. So yeah, I don't think I want to time. That. All passes. Holy shit. Just barely on that four, though. Yeah. Okay, then we're on to Belagar. I delay my turn, since Jerome wants me to wait. Vincent, you're up. So even though I'm on the tippy edge of it, do I have to make some sort of strength check or acrobatics check to get out? Oh, yep, you have to make a strength check. 
or spirit uh, blast? I'm just gonna light my torch and burn it. Okay. It's only about like D three damage. Two D four. Not pleasant, but it's it's the better option than making all these absurdly high DC checks. Six points. And that starts the web on fire for all of us. Yeah. Uh, yes. It it, it five expands around, right? by five feet around. Yeah. Plus, I can't see even if I get out, I can't see anything on the other side of the web. They have total cover, so I can't help any of you. Okay. At least until you catch fire. Are you done? Uh, so I can move out of it now that it's on fire, right? Uh, no, because it takes the round to burn. Okay, it's my turn then. Okay, I'm gonna try a. So it's a D, gonna be DC 16 spellcraft. You get good spellcraft, right? Yes. Oh, there it so is. you get an enlar an enlarged person. Okay. Just make me large, John. I'm big. Need to go check what enlarged person does in your thing, because I think you have it different. Yeah, mine's way better. Yeah. And, and then I'm gonna try two uh, miners on you. Which is 8 HP? Uh, a, a, a HP back. Okay. I'm turning you into a monster. Go kill. Okay. <laughs> uh, sorry, John. I need to take a second to go look at it in large person. I don't have it up. Uh, gives you a natural armor bonus of one, and a dex penalty of one, so it doesn't affect your armor class. And then it makes your weapon do fifty percent more damage and gives you ten foot reach. Okay. It gives you plus two strength, but minus one attack from being large. So, so it again out. doesn't affect it, but makes you do more damage. Oh, so I have 30 strength now. <laughs> That's absurd for level three. Okay. So Do you have me... 30 strength? Oh, yeah, both strength, right? Both strength and rage, I, baby. I buffed the crap out of him. All right, so 30 strength. So that's going to do nothing. So let's see. I guess I'm going to attack. Uh. This guy first. I hate him. He's bad. Shaman, I've learned my lesson. He looks all weird. I'm not touching You get him. a minus two penalty for uh, being entangled. Yep. So, minus two. And you we got... suffer a dex penalty as well. Yeah, I got a string weapon. So, minus two. Oh, and plus you'll two, be very disappointed 11. to hear that your armor class goes down by two because you're large now and your dex drops. <laughs> Bro, who cares? <laughs> Oh yeah, you're also minus one for being size large. The AC is, they fail if they really crit fail. That's it. Alright, I need to... Instead of right, hitting you on fours, game. they now hit you on fours. Alright, that's a hit on them. This uh, should absolutely obliterate this guy. Alright, here's the damage. 38 damage. I'm going to cleave through. That's 24 on one, 25 on one guy. Cleave through to an illusion. Fuck this illusion. I think I should cleave to the shaman? Uh, well, I don't even know if I can cleave through to the shaman, can I? Yep. Oh, uh, okay, I'll just clear through the shaman and hit one of his illusions then. Okay. That'll be my turn. Does he need to roll concealment, or does blur only affect the main guy? No, he has to roll concealment, so you got to roll above 20%. Nope. Haha. <laughs> roll like shit. For sure. Okay, Love it. Okay, then we're back to initiative. Anything else I can do to help him out? Oh, wait, I forgot to heal too. There we go. Magic weapon personal? I don't think, think so. so. No? Read the spell. T weapon touched? Ooh, okay. Belagar got a second to uh, let me touch your weapon. <laughs> Touch your weapon inappropriately. You're just threatening me with innuendos these, these last couple of rounds. I feel threatened. <laughs> I'm scared. He wants will, to make you big. I will cleave in self-defense, I swear. 
<laughs> I'm just gonna do a little reach around onto no, the stop. <laughs> Sorry, Egan, you're a little far to do this all to you. It's okay. I'll either <laughs> live or I'll die. If I die, I die. If I live, I live. <laughs> you're actually <laughs> completely and totally safe at the moment because they're all yeah. attacking Belagar. Well, I know. There's literally too much web between you and them for them to do anything to you. Well, only had a benign okay, transportation. Okay, so let's now. start with our Scorching Ray. Sadly, I'm out of second level spells. Or oh, that would be really funny. I would have been transpo transposited myself or someone in the web with the shaman or something. No, the shaman would have made the save easily. Eh, probably, yeah. That's a hit. It's next to impossible not to hit me. <laughs> I know. That's why I'm targeting you. Oh, 17 points of yeah, fire damage. Jesus. Ow. And then let's follow that up with... Everyone shoots at me, I guess. Days. Yeah, what? Now that you're big and an obvious threat... Oh, I pass. Okay, well then roll it again. A meanie. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> there we go. Duh. Uh, <laughs> There's not much any of us can do about that one, bud. I gotta re-roll it with a fate point, but I'm thinking, is it worth the odds? Probably. Oh, uh, fuck it. I'll use another fate point. No! <laughs> it's over. You just fate pointed it and still lost? Yeah, well, I mean, what can I do? Alright. So I'm dazed. You could have just accepted that you were dazed for a round. Well, I... It, it's bad. It looks bad, alright? The map looks bad. I need to do something. <laughs> That's fine. I got, like, two fate points now. I need to write six million articles to make up for this. I guess I'll put the... Well, I guess I'm not giving you a magic weapon this turn. Yeah, I'll put daze on myself. Anything else? Oh, he's done, and then they get to all shoot me, right? No, they go. Oh later. yeah. Oh wait, well, yeah. They, they go in a couple of turns, but yeah. Okay. Is that it for your so, shaman? Egan, you're up. Alrighty. So I passed my my breakout last turn. How far can I move? You have to roll a strength check. Uh, DC ten. You can move five feet for every. Uh, Five feet, you exceed the check by. Oh, oh yes. Yes. thirty! Run him down, son. Run him down. So you can move thirty feet. Get him! <laughs> Get him! I can move thirty feet. Oh, no, you can only twenty move, feet. Yeah, it would only be twenty-five, twenty or twenty-five. Well, I mean, you'll get out of the web by then, so. It's still, yeah, you're still 25. getting out. I can get, get to him! That does I can take get your whole turn. Yeah, that's your action for the round. Just keep pushing, just keep pushing. Okay. Fuck it, I'm gonna push up next to him, maybe distract him, get him to focus me instead of Belagar. Good, good plan. Alright, um... Concentrate all firepower on Egan. Oh, oh no, to... I will yes. die! I'm going to try another spellcraft to heal Egan with a Faith Heal 1. You get 11 hit points back, and then we'll try two more miners. Oh, that, no, don't, no. That, that's not worth it. I'm at fucking 39 out of 41. Do not heal me. He's not healing you. He can't even he, touch you. He, yeah, I'm healing Belgar. Yeah, he said your name on accident, but okay. he's trying to heal me. Oh, yeah. Okay, I was like, I was like... You get another eight hit points. All right, back to 40. You go, girl. <laughs> My body. Uh, then it is the hunter's turn, so they will move out of these threatened squares. Just huddle against the wall. 
At least he can probably almost like step up there without any uh, issue. Yeah, I can just make a check. And then there's five of them, so they'll all attack Belagar. Yeah. Oh, pink fuck. Let's see if they, there's any red. Please be all red. If there's all red, God loves me. Dimples loves me. Oh, no. That's not all red. Nothing That's not all hit. All right, let's see. 5d6. And a crit. Oh, no. He's lugging it up. He's fighting for his life. Of course he's lucking it up. Let me kill you. <laughs> oh, wow, it does it. Oh, it a nine. That hits too, doesn't it? Yeah, he rolled a four. That's that a confirm. Holy fuck. <laughs> you're laughing. I'm getting pelted and you're laughing. <laughs> 12 points of crit damage and then okay. four more hits. Yeah, so just 46. No damage. Oh, but it's... Oh, God. Six, six damage. Okay. Let me make a roll. A roll? You mean five rolls. That's what I meant. I'll pass this. Okay. Uh, I think that's everyone? Yeah. Holy fuck. You guys slaughtered a lot of my guys really quickly. Uh, then, Vincent, you're up. Uh, so this thing is burning now? Yep. I need a DM call. Is this... Uh... Sorry, I had to go through the stupid line menu. Is this uh, three squares or four squares of web? Hang on. That was such a lucky 20 on Aegon's part. Holy. Yeah. Yeah, nice. but you know what that means? I can start beating the shit out of this fucking shaman. Yeah, you got cleave. I think you can cleave through his, uh, his mirrors. Bless you. Bless you. Ow. That was a hard one. Uh, that would be one, two, three. It'd be at least three, yeah. So it's only three, though. Because it's four to, for total cover, which is what I'm curious about. Oh, four for total cover, yeah. So if you're shooting yeah. through there, you yeah. So I will put them all asleep. Um, I have nine hit dice affected. So the shaman, they have the CR one dudes have two hit dice, right? The CR one are all two hit dice. So sadly, the shaman will not be affected. Assuming okay. this guy over here that How I can many... barely see is a CR one dude. Okay. And uh, I assume they can't see me because I was still. Well, they can see the fire, but. Um, yeah, you just lit yourself on fire. You're definitely not hidden. Okay, fair enough. DC 17. <laughs> well, let's see four rolls. Let's see if they got the juice. Fail. Pass. Fail. All right. That's the majority of them. Oh, not that Who's much. the fifth one? The, the shaman doesn't have to roll. I don't have enough hit dice. Oh, okay. So two Sadly. Three, oh, three fails fail. and I'll pass. That's still pretty good. Now I'm curious. Yeah, Power Word Sleep would have been awesome here. Well. Why would Power Word Sleep have been awesome? Because then I could have got the Shaman too, but probably would have made it anyways. Actually, yeah, right there, 20, he would have made it. All right, so three of them fall asleep, and um, that's my turn. I'll, I'll daze the fourth one, and I'll try and daze the Shaman, I guess. Why not? Okay. Shaman gets a twenty, and who? Another the other, is... the other guy that saved against the sleep. Twenty-one. Damn. Well, I tried. Nothing but net. That's my turn. Okay, so Belagar stops being dazed, and then we're back to initiative. Yep, I just healed too. I rage while standing here doing nothing. I oh, know, right? I'm just slowly healing. I'm just healing here menacingly. <laughs> oh, no! Ah. Uh. Rolls like shit. Nothing personal. Good. Okay, so the shaman will five foot back. And 
and we'll hit Aegon with a Scorching Ray. Seventeen. For twelve points of damage. That sucks, I'm at a third level, or at a second level spell. I was just thinking, oh, I could use, use other abilities and save some of my spells, but I've already burned through all of my spells. Okay, then you can roll your days. I can roll my days. Yep. But I will save. Join us in the days club. We'll save. Uh, DC 15. Bless is still active, correct? Yeah. Yep. Mm. I'm dazed. Nice. Okay, so then let's daze Belagar again. What the hell? You don't seem to I'm mind when a... your mage does it. I'm being oppressed right now. Thankfully, You're I'm really built different. Oppressed. I'm built different, all right? Fair enough. Vincent, you're up. Uh, I'm going to cast another sleep right here. See if I can uh, put, the, put them all out. Okay. Uh, that won't 17. get the guy at the bottom, though. Uh, correct. It wasn't that guy already asleep? No, he was the guy that you couldn't reach. <clears throat> oh, okay. Uh, well, fuck. Um, if I target it here, does it, does it waste hit dice on people who are already asleep? No. Okay, yeah, I'll just target it there. Okay. So two saves for those uh, weak guys and the save for the shaman. Or whatever order you want to do it. For some reason my bonus didn't go in, but he's plus seven, which would give him an 18. Uh, I would luck that down by three. Okay. What's the save? DC 17. So if he lucks it up by two, it would be a 17? Correct. Done. He does not want to go to sleep. Uh, Understandable. And then the other guy rolls an 18 naturally. God damn it. They're not sleeping right now, right? It's awake time. Wait, he has a plus five? Yeah, they all have a plus five. The hunters have plus fives? Yeah. Yeah, God it's damn. their best save. They get three as a base and two for wisdom. Wow, okay. I said that when oh, you first started experts. casting. Oh, he has experts, that's right. Okay, I remember now. I was thinking because they're hunters and they have bows, their dexterity save, whatever. Roll the third one. Third one for who? Didn't you say this guy's still awake? No, the the guy south of him. The guy south of him? Oh, I see. Yeah, no, You just I can't, can't see him around the corner. I, I can't reach him. No, I understand that, but that was my point, is that there is another one there. I didn't know where you... I couldn't tell where you could see, just that you said you were putting a sleep up there, and I yeah, figured who you were hitting. I'll try and daze the shaman. Okay. Come on, let's score some fucking dazes. Oh. Try and daze him again. Oh, that's there we go. Oh. That's what you want to see. Uh, three points shy. Wait, maybe I'll get a chance to wreck this fucking shaman next turn. That's my turn. That is okay, so Jerome, you take... Oh no, I take damage. Two okay. points of burning. Yeah, I can make that spell crap check. It tastes like burning. It's tingly. And then it is the hunters go. They're two up. And the two hunters will wake up the two not uh, awake hunter. Well, there's three not awake hunters. Yeah, I tried. Oh, well, I don't think that that's reasonable. 
I was hoping I could put them all asleep so that no one could wake up anyone. But nope, that is out. that is the the downside of sleep is if you don't get everyone, it kind of uh, blows up in your face. But they did lay on the ground for two rounds. Okay, so the two hunters that are awake will shoot Belagar. Okay. Two hits. See the deeps. Who's just a human or dwarven pincushion at the moment? I know. Oh, oh it's sleeping time. Anybody got any, anybody got any luck? Anybody luck? I'm out of luck. But it, you only need a plus one, so someone else yeah. has luck. I'm out of luck. I Egan, have one luck. last fucking luck. Save me, Egan. Save me. Do it. You are saved. Thank you. <laughs> I don't think Amber. I've used luck on myself at all this session. Well, you got that antitoxin potion you've drunk, and so... Oh, yeah, or you just, got delay poison. He so just has delay got... poison. He's actually are we, great. Are we keeping track of any poisons that he's been getting? For I poison? haven't hit. I haven't been hit by poison at all. Oh, wow. They've all been bullying me. Yeah, because you can fail the poison save. Yeah. Well, they don't know that. Yeah, they don't know that. <laughs>